Hello children, welcome to my YouTube channel. So children, in our last two classes, we have uh, studied about the categories of computer and computer languages, right? So in today's session, we are going to discuss about language processors, okay? So as we all know children, computer understands only the machine language is. Yes. So if the program is written in any other language, it has to be converted into machine language first in order for the computer to understand it. So in order to translate any high level language program into machine language, we need a software. So this software is called as language processor or language translator. So what is a language translator? Language translator is a software which is required to convert a high level language program into machine language program. So what are the three different types of language translators we have? We have three different types of language translators. Those are assembler, interpreter and compiler. So we will see what is an assembler. Assembler is a translator program which will convert assembly language program into machine language program. What is an assembler children? Assembler is a translator program which will convert an assembly language program into machine language program. The program which is written in the assembly language is called as source program whereas the program which is converted into machine language is called as object program. Yes. So next we will move on to the second type of language translator which is interpreter. So what is an interpreter? Interpreter is a translator program which is used to convert high level language program into machine language program. Okay. So what interpreter does? It translates the high level language program into machine language program line by line. Okay. So the execution speed of the interpreter is little slower okay since it is it is translating the program line by line the execution speed of the interpreter is slower next we will move on to the next third type of the language translator which is compiler so what is compiler compiler is again a translator program which is used to convert high level language program into machine language program so if compiler is also converting the high level language program into machine language program, so what is the difference between a compiler and interpreter then? Interpreter translates the program line by line, whereas compiler translates the program at once. Okay. So once it is once the program is compiled, it will generate the object code for that program. Along with that, it will give a list of errors okay the execution speed of the compiler is faster as compared to the interpreter so in this chapter children we have studied about the language processors today we will quickly summarize what in all concepts we have studied in chapter 1 which is categories of computer and computer languages so when, when we started we discussed about the different categories of the computer so how many categories of computers we have we have four types of computers so how they are categorized they are categorized based on their speed storage capacity size and cost so what are the four different types of computer children microcomputer mini computer mainframe computer and supercomputers so after discussing, when we were discussing the microcomputers, we came across handheld devices, right? So what are handheld devices? Handheld devices are the small devices which are smaller in size and can be held in hand. Examples for the handheld devices, children? Smartphones and tablet computers, yes. So after that, we studied about embedded system. So what is an embedded system? Embedded system is the one that has computer hardware with software which is embedded inside a larger device. The larger device can be television, microwave, washing machines, etc. Okay. So embedded system is embedded inside larger devices. 
then we also studied about what is a program and what is programming so what is a program children program is a set of instructions which will instruct the computer what to do and what is programming programming is the process of writing specific instructions in a computer language okay so today we studied that computer understands only the machine language so in order to convert any high level language into machine language we need translator so we studied about three different types of translators so what are these three different types of translators they are assembler interpreter and compiler so what is the difference between interpreter and compiler interpreter translates the program line by line but compiler translates the whole program at once so i hope children you are familiar with all the topics you are um, everything is clear to you if you have any queries you please write down in the comment box your queries okay so children if you are finding my videos useful to you please subscribe to my channel thank you